How you doing guys? This is Ivory Steel. Welcome to Hydroneer Valcalidus, the DLC for Hydroneer. And today I'm going to be talking about this machine. This is the Hardstone machine. Now I've spoken about now I've spoken about this machine in a couple of my videos. Like I've actually used it and I've showed you how it works and so on and so forth. But I haven't done a dedicated video as to why they exist in the first place. So I've mentioned it, haven't talked about it. So this is a brand new thing that's been put into Hydroneer. We can now we can now build blocks of hardstone, which is what these are. It's a block of hardstone. Now hardstone is just another like it's another piece of um, element that we can now use to sell. We can also use it to build stuff. So dotted around the game, there are these all riggy things. You can go and check them out. I did a video for them a little while ago. And basically, what they do is they create ores, but you need hardstone to create them. Now some of you may have already been like a shot ahead of this, which means you don't really need to know this, but what you can also do with it is you create the shops in the town as well. They need a little bit of hardstone and a little bit of persuasion, and then from there it's basically, well, it, they're basically, uh, they're building blocks for shops and things that are dotted around the land. Now I haven't found another reason for them to be, and they come up as a random thing that you're going to get from elements. So stuff that you'll be drilling from downstairs. Occasionally hardstone is one of the things that's going to come up. And, well, you can sell it. That's pretty much the whole thing. It's a bit like the other new thing, which is diamond. A diamond is another jewel that you can use to actually basically sell. Create it into, like, pendants and, well, necklaces and rings and things like that. And at the end of the day, you're able to do this. Which means you've got new stuff to play with and new stuff to sell. And obviously, when it comes down to the customers that are going to want, like, a sword or something else, they, you know, if they're looking for jewellery, they might ask for a diamond. I haven't found anybody who wants hardstone though now currently as you can see i'm saving up for nine 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 and i'm basically hoping at some point i hit it just to see how much it's worth that's really all i'm doing now because i've unlocked all the shops in the game and i've unlocked all the stuff that's actually dotted around the land i don't really need hardstone anymore so i'm basically just waiting until it hits the top mac and then we're gonna like it auto feeds and i want to see how much it's worth it's pretty much where i'm at right now so yeah I don't really know. There are a couple of things in this DLC I'm a little bit like, you know, you get to a point where you don't need things anymore. Like the ore rigs. I haven't got a reason for them because I'm mining. I don't really need hardstone anymore. So it's just a commodity that I can sell. Now I can understand having diamond because it's a, it's a thing that we can sell that basically or we can put it into a necklace if, if need be. You know, because we might get asked for that order. But hardstone is a very strange thing. It is used for construction, but I've got to a point where I don't need to build anything else. It's very cool. But at the end of the day, at least I'm sort of happy. Now, the reason why I've set it up like this, so I've got it so it just drops into the actual hardstone compressor instead of just having a, a vertical up, is because I've actually found it easier to build my mine like sorting area above the ground in this one. Well, because of the lava pipe that's underneath. Now, I already feed cable underneath my build, so I've got like the button that basically I can turn these on and off, and that's fine. But in order for having like water and the lava, I'm finding it easier to build above ground and basically have everything drop into it. So that's why I've set this up where you just feed straight into the actual compressor itself. So, yeah, you can take that with a grain of salt, take it, you know, put it into your own builds and so on and so forth if you really want to. But at the end of the day, it is just one of those things. That's how I found it easier to actually set it up. So, yeah. Um, I don't really have much else to say about it. It's basically a new element that we can use as a commodity to sell after you've done all the important things like opening up all the shops and opening up the uh, ore drills. That's really about it. I know this video has been a little bit shorter, but at the end of the day, it's all good. I've showed you the hard stone and I've also showed you the brand new element, which is diamond. Gives us a little bit of something else that we can sell and mess around with. And at the same time, we've got building blocks. It's all good. I might build a statue or something out of the blocks and just maybe, I don't know, maybe knock them off at a thousand each and just build a little house. We'll see how things go. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, hit me, let me know in the comment section. Hit the like, subscribe and notification button below for all of the updates. And I'll be back here with a brand new video live stream or whatever else to do on the channel. Until then, peace out, have fun, enjoy everything you guys do. A boom! Fist bump to you.